Hello, this is our take on the Associated Press versus Ferry, which was a t case that t revolves around the Hope poster, which was symbolic during Obama's run in 2008. After the, uh, the 2008 election, 2009, Obama, the Obama Hope poster then became a legal dispute over the Associated Press versus Ferry. The original photographer named Manny Garcia took issue with the fact Ferry copied his image and, be and used it to sell and increase its own value. Um, at that point, Garcia then came to an agreement with Ferry in addition to Associated Press to share the earnings. All right. I, I have a good question for you three, and, and that is, what is copyright? Which is a very important question to ask, especially since this is a copyright case. Uh, I think copyright is the right that you're given when you create something that's your own. Yeah, I think it's someone's ownership over their own, their own work, their own creative work. Alright, um, well... If that's the case, and it's someone's ownership over something, how can that be protected? Um, when you go to one of the branches of government and you pay for that copyright, uh, no one else can take it, and it could last uh, almost a lifetime. And yeah, copyright can be registered, so you, it usually lasts a lifetime, and sometimes it can be more than that, depending on the situation. Basically, you're making a legal document of it, of what you made. All right. Um, well, how do you register your copyright? And it, is there any way to keep it from being infringed upon? Uh, yeah. Like, with the branches of government, you can, you know, pay. Or you could, um, for a cheaper alternative, you can get it registered and to have the date and that you made it and the date you posted it so you can have proof that was yours. Yeah, you can register your copyright to keep anyone from stealing it or any problems that may occur. Uh, okay, alright, alright. Well, can a copyright be removed and how long does it last before it has to be renewed? It usually lasts between uh, 90 to 100 years, and you can keep renewing it over time. Okay. Um, well, what can renew copyright? Is, can it be anything, or does it have to be a specific thing? Uh, anything could have copyright. It could be art, music, uh, books. Anything could... You, you can even renew it every single time, and usually if... Uh, families and companies pay to keep it copyrighted. Well, how is this case important to copyright in and of, it them, of its, itself then? It has to do with credit, and I think that's a really important thing when it comes to copyright. Because if you don't give people proper credit, then you're infringing upon the copyright laws. Basically stealing it. Mm-hmm. Well, what requires for work to actually be eligible if, you know, this person very took ownership, technically, of this photo and started trying to sell it. As soon as you create something, it's eligible. It's your own creative work. So, the photo, when it was originally taken, was the photographer's own picture and not fairies since he took it, right? Right. Okay. Um, well, did you feel this was justified at all, the case? Like, did it feel at all like Ferry was in the right, or if it felt like there were any legal issues that Ferry or the Associated Press took into account? Uh, I think it was kind of like for both sides, because they ag agreed that if that photo wasn't edited, and it wasn't for... Obama's uh, pres uh, election, then they, the original photographer would never have gotten as much money. And even if it was split, he, they still wouldn't have enough uh, as much money. Well, I feel like I should ask then, does 
something have to generate income for it to be violating copyright? Or can anything, even if it doesn't generate income, violate, co violate copyright? Uh, even simple as copy and pasting for an essay violates copyright, and some people are even, uh, okay. or, you know, they get into big trouble. Mm -hmm. Yeah, plagiarism. Well, this will be my last question, but what did you learn about copyright, especially in this case, and, like, what was the takeaway with this case? Did it leave you with anything? I think we all agree that it's really about the importance of giving credit to the owner of the work. Yeah, and I even learned that copyright was the right that is given to a piece of work. I used to think it was something you took from another person. I didn't think copyright was this serious. I thought like you just, if you copyrighted someone, you just have to pay that person money, you know, share those profits from what you copyrighted with that person from stealing their stuff. All right, this was our take on the Associated Press versus Ferry.